Hey everyone, so this is a, uh, a video I've been really looking forward to doing for a long, long time and it's, uh, it's going to be a new series on learning Ethereum from, from the very beginning, right? So I think you know, this is not a, a video about what Ethereum is. Um, I guess if you're interested in, in, in watching this video, you kind of know what it is and, and I'll, I'll, I'll give a background um, probably in a separate video. But uh, you know, Ethereum obviously is the, let's say it's a, an evolution of some of the technologies that the Bitcoin really pioneered, um, in particular the blockchain. But, it, but Ethereum is a way to, um, to, to do, do more interesting things on the blockchain. Um, so if you've heard of smart contracts, um, executable code that can be deployed to a blockchain and, and run on the blockchain, and it's opening up all sorts of possibilities. There's a huge amount of work being done all over the world on, um, by, by different institutions playing around with Ethereum, playing around with the concept. So it's a very, very exciting topic and uh, I'm really excited to, to, to kind of show you guys how to install it and, and hopefully um, take you along the way. Um, and if you follow me, hopefully you, you guys will, uh, will, will know exactly how to run, to install, to run, to program stuff on Ethereum and, and, and have fun with it. Okay, so today's video is literally just gonna be um, just installing it, nothing else. Um, and then I'm gonna try and do a video every week um, where we gradually build up the knowledge. One small disclaimer is that I'm kind of learning this as I go along as well. I haven't actually, um, I haven't actually played with this myself yet, but I've been doing a little bit of scouting around and, and, and uh, um, so I kind of have an idea of the direction I want to take it, but um, you really are sort of learning with me. So that's kind of cool. Um, but I suppose if you've got in-depth uh, questions about Ethereum um, for the time being, I might not be able to answer them, okay? So let's get going, all right? So I'm gonna put all the links down below and all the instructions and all the commands and everything so you can see, you'll, you'll see them in the window, but you can actually copy and paste them into your own thing. So we start with a, um, the, the instructions for installing this on um, Mac. So I, I work on uh, a Mac. Um, I find it uh, um, slightly easier to, to, to do the, um, the sort of command line stuff. But, um, so we're gonna sort of go through some of these, but all the instructions will be linked down below. Now, so the first thing we do is we're gonna um, install Homebrew. Homebrew is the sort of uh, package manager for, for Mac. So you, won't, you don't need to do this um, on Windows, but uh, so let's do that. So we're gonna run this command up here, right? Um, again, paste it below. So I'm gonna hit return to install Homebrew. Password. And this takes, uh, so this takes a, a couple of minutes. So we'll just skip to the end of that. Okay, so that's completed, right? So uh, we have Homebrew installed. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna, uh, we're gonna install Ethereum, right? Which is a pretty straightforward command. And then we do brew install Ethereum. So what we're what we're installing here is the um, is the command line uh, interface for Ethereum written in the Go language. It's called Geth, and it's um, so you'll see it's a very it's a very neat kind of interface, and you can do all the commands and, and you know m most of what you need to do in, eth in Ethereum using this interface. Um, so it's just, it's one implementation of the um, of the Ethereum protocol, um, but it's it's a very popular one. Okay, so that's that's now done. So if I type Geth, you can see I'm going to Control C out of there. Then so get get is the is the command that you're going to use to launch the the console. So if I run get without any other commands, any other flags, what this is doing is actually in a, in a default um, folder here, which is um, under my library at get chain data folder. This is actually starting to download the entire Ethereum blockchain, or like the the, the live one. So um, so that's shown that we've we've actually installed get. Um, 
we, I'm not going to actually download the entire Ethereum blockchain. I just, just wanted to show you the basic thing running. Um, that's it. That's, that's the installation process for GET. So in the next video, what I'm going to do is show you how to create a, a private test network so that you can mine your own blocks and, and, and so you can send and receive um, Ether, Ether, which is the, the, the underlying currency in, 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 in um, Ethereum. And you can do all that without having to spend real money and you can so you set up your own mining nodes in a private network and, and, and have all the kind of um, all the fun you want with that. So, so that's going to be the subject of the next video. Um, so yeah, very short video on how to get started. I hope you'll follow along with me and, uh, and, and, and you know, I think it's going to be uh, an exciting journey. All right, so see you in the next one.